Hey guys, one of the most deadly prescriptions for a transaction or a negotiation is the entrance of those pesky little things called emotions. Understanding that emotions have no place in a transaction. Now, I know some of you are saying, man, I've watched some old school negotiators come at it real hard and they tend to get what they want. Well, the bottom line there is in many of those cases, that's actually a tactic that even if they're being overtly emotional, what looks to be emotional, that inside they've really got everything together, that that can really throw off the person that they're negotiating with to now make some decisions that might not be in their best interest because they have now gotten their emotion up. We see this a lot with fighters too. In that pre-fight, they get all into it and angry and in the stare down at the beginning. Um, a lot of that is to create emotion in the opposite fighter so that they then do things that they normally would not do. So guys, as your position as a realtor, as an attorney, as an agent in sports, in any of these, it is your job to keep emotion out of the mix on behalf of your clients so that they're not forced even by accident to make a decision that may not be best for them. The success of you, your client, and those around you literally depend on you staying cool.